So, welcome back to the next session of Talos Principle. I think the last thing we did was getting this one, which is the fan. Yeah, we can see it in the lower left corner. So, next will be two. Yeah. B2. I see all. I know all. My power knows no bounds. And yet your will is free because you were made to be free. It is the very principle of your existence without which the trials of this world would hold no meaning. To seek salvation must be your choice. I have come to see that these mysteries are not all for his children to solve. Only the designer himself could ever truly understand the infinite complexity of his creation. I will gaze at his work and worship. One with faith again. I have no idea what's going on, do you? Barry Joe. I think that are notes that I left during my first playthrough of this. But I'm not quite sure. Searching for more QR codes. I've seen the computer. I've seen the other thing. What's that? Paint. Ah, that's how you leave messages. Yeah. So you take up your bucket. And I paint a message next to I can paint I can paint I can paint there. Okay. Of rocks are people too. <laughs> okay. So you can paint one message and then the bucket is gone. Does it reappear? No. Okay. Good to know. Had to remind me of that. So in the other one where we saw a message from myself, that's also one where we could have found a bucket if we had searched thoroughly. Okay, so let's hear. I keep having these dreams. Great empty cities, silent roads stretching for miles, the earth from space all dark not a single light to guide me home but if someone really came from another world what would the earth look like to them a wilderness a wasteland i don't think so even after thousands of years they'd see a world shaped by our hand in every aspect of its being they'd see the cities and the roads the bridges the harbors and they would say here lived a race of giants. These dreams, they scare me, but they also remind me that we built all of this. Interesting. How can we go to the computer? Science magic. Though the term science has only meant what it does to us for around 600 years, its practice far predates the name. There's evidence pre-Aristotle, which indicates soothsayers, mystics and the like may have employed basic scientific methods to predict the future, future and confound their benefactors. One anecdote concerns a palm reader who was exposed when two wealthy clients compared their readings and found them to be identical. In 1948, the tendency to discover deep personal meaning in vague descriptions delivered author authoritative, authoritative, authoritatively was given a name, Fora Effect. Today it is recognized in all contemporary physiological terror te theory. Weight loss. 
Oh man, if there's one thing that's good about inevitable, in inevitable death, it's the food. Yeah, baby. I'm going to have all the horribly unhealthy food in the world. I'm going to feast on jelly bananas like a crazy monkey on monkey Christmas. And you know those muffins that have so much chocolate that they are basically melting? That's gonna be my breakfast and burgers for lunch. I'm gonna have burgers so greasy you could use them to lubricate a whole factory. Triple bacon burgers with double cheese and extra onions and mayonnaise and ketchup and mustard and big fat juicy patties. And then oily thick pizza with spicy salami and barbecue sauce and olives and jalapenos and sour creams. Food coma, here I come. Yeah, that's a great thing, thing to do last. Arcadi Journal 81 Fascinated by Drennan's project, lovely conversations, read Talos Principle, Greek philosophy, relevance to current situations, suggesting naming project Talos. Drennan refused, but name seems to have caught on with the team. Tens of thousands of fires coming in every hour. hour. Our whole history. Okay. So, what's in this world? A red one, three yellow ones. I think we should su supposedly start with this one as it's first fan puzzle we ever did. We also have one star here, which I've seen no evidence of yet. So let's start with this one. Man on the moon. Okay, these are the fans. You can attach fans to these pads, which make them move if it's that way. So I think the best solution would be to power one of those up. And use that to go over. There's star up there, no? And we have to put one here. Okay. I know exactly how to do that. That's great. I'll take a fan. Jump here. Use the fan to activate the plate. As you know, that's just the wires. Okay. Interesting. So far. Okay. That's the red one. I think we'll do the red one last. So let's do... Not that one. That looks so... Uh... That looks interesting. I think I will do that one last. So this one and then the red one. Fan box. And this one. Oh, moonshot. So I have to... Do something with this one. Okay, I'll have to put it there. Okay, that's an interesting thing. So, what we're gonna do is we take that one off, take this one here, connect it, put it on top, and have it flow. I really like these kinds of puzzles. They're great. Oh. Okay, we got the first thing for weightlifting. It's great. We're going to be we're going to get small. And the red one. Higher ground. Okay. Okay, this is like... Okay, this is like... Okay... Like a labyrinth, which I'm gonna have to go through, so we can get through here. Inside that, we have a gemmer there. I gem this one to get to the keys. There's also two bombs over there.
So getting the keys. Then this one to go there. I'm just gonna look. Okay, I'm going out. Okay, I'm not losing the key for that. That's great. So we'll have to look what. I think I can reach with, uh, more with that one. I can point it there. I can take it with me, of course. On the thing. Take it with me. Not moving on. Okay. Epitaph Child Program, codename One with Faith, terminated here. Worship the designer for a number of days, then allowed the serpent into its heart. Find a memory dome. I ask the designer for forgiveness that I may join him in the eternal memory. And their progeny programs are Ed, Samsara, and Sheep. And we read, read already from both of those. I guess someone met their end here. Seems we are all connected somehow, like distant family or relations. What are we? Who cares? Just be grateful. We don't have to read anything more about our great designer. Okay. So, first things first. I'll go there. Try to... Okay, we need to go here. To have one of them blocked. So... Not that one. What are you opening in the moment? Are you opening that one? Okay. Okay, we don't need that one right now, so I wanna open that. <coughs> Take this one. And just stop one of those. To be perfectly offset and go on. Okay. So put that one back again. Yeah, some of these red runs are long. Very long. Okay, we can have the possibility to. Yeah, we can't have the possibility to, like, take more of those with us. Okay. Oh, the perfect offsetting didn't work as it was supposed to. Just run to the side and go through and we have that again. Okay. Okay. I'm just looking at what we can get here. So we have to... Wow, how do we do that? Oh no, we have to retake the key. Okay. That's the first thing, first thing we should do. Oh, not that one. First thing, key. Second thing. Oh, we need we need to have one pointed that way. So okay, I know how we do that. Interesting. already pointed at that. Point this at that. We can take you with us. To stop on here. This is not the middle. That's what going what's going wrong here. So I'll have to let him a bit through like there. Okay. So what I'm doing now is regretting that I did something wrong here. So I'm gonna jam that one. I still can't get past that.
and jam that one. Ah, yeah, yeah, of course. And then I'm gonna jam the end. <coughs> so I set myself up with the solution to all of this. And we're still too stupid. And because of that, I have to run up here again. And yeah, that would be nice. Do it that way. As soon as possible. Now. Now wait until the other one reaches the end. So they're offset by quite a bit. Also waiting until it turns around and I'm waiting one, two, three. Okay. And going back in. Taking that with me. Using keys. Leaving that here. And nearly running into the bomb because I'm stupid. Okay. So now... Middle. Now to run across. I don't want to have to set that up again. Okay. We again entered just after one. So we have to go past that. Go past that. Have to wait until it's gone. Uh, we can take the thing. Nothing is here. No star. It was where the messenger was supposed to be, but... They're not getting anything of that, so the star has to be inside there. Okay. We get a message from the mid library assistant. Here's a spot I've been wondering why you were off carrying out commandments. You say that consciousness is some kind of functional system. Arrange bits of matter in the right order and outspring sentience. sentience. That's all very well on paper, but what counts is what something does, not what it's made of. Then couldn't you and I design a series of tin cans on strings that qualified as being conscious? Yes, naturally. What a bizarre idea. I sent you a notification when the signpost starts complaining. Seriously, though, are the tides and the ecosystem sentient as well? Any organized system qualifies? Tides and ecosystems. The ecosystem is sentient. Sure. You're quite mad. I'm sure of it. Do of not course. think I know not the deceiver slithering through the hidden words. His wisdom is hollow and born of despair. Do not let him tangle you in his webs of delusion. Have faith in me, and his petty illusions will fall away like nightmares in the morning's light. You're quite mad, I'm sure of it. Of course, the alternative accounts are all so ridiculous, you would be forgiven by any reasonable observer for choosing the best of the bad bunch. How consciousness can be so intimately familiar to you and yet so obscure, I just don't understand. Don't mind him, he's just void that if you ask too many questions, you will start to see through his stick. Stick with me and the sky will quite literally be the limit. At any rate, I'd like you to think a bit hard about all this and get back to me. I'm sure there's still progress to be made. Terminating support session, resuming library archive session. So, the Milton Library Assistant is the one I've been talking about all the time, spoiling the shit out of you. But I just didn't remember it was that long. <clears throat> okay, so I get that I'm supposed to retrieve these sigils, I just don't get why. I'm sure the loud voice is telling me to. But this word of his has no context, no purpose, and no foundations from which to construct them. I'm convinced there are answers here if we look hard enough. We have to work together on this. So dog and sheep are working together. That's great. So that's what we have to get. Go in there, and we have a problem. Okay. 
we have no connector, so we can't do that at first. No back opening here. There's a red one. And we have a connector, so first thing first is to connect those two. So we can go through here and get an another connector. Yes, we can. Okay. So this is... We'll make it... Oh, make it another way. We'll connect this, 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 and this. And place it here. So... We can take this with us, so we don't have to tangle us around here. And we get the sigil. But there has to be a star. And these laser puzzles are the most likely to have one. Okay. So, I think I'm doing that. As they are the most likely to have a star, I have today this one here. So I can use it from straight across if I want to. Or is it like somewhere hidden in the dark? Wow! It is! Okay. So that's very much easier. I have to take the long way around. Because I wouldn't be able to get it through here, but I can go back. Yeah. So that's the thing about this playthrough not being blind, because I remembered that somewhere there was something where. Okay. Okay. I have mm, here a red one. Here a red one. Okay. Okay, I think I'm taking both connectors out of here so I can pull a red laser out of another puzzle and point it at this one. So, this not being blind makes it so that I remember such little things like I remember. At some place I searched for an eternity and finally got the solution by looking it up. Oh, we have to take the gemma with us. We want to get the connector. Now we have to take the gemma with us to open the door. And go there. I just remember, the, like this nook, it's, it's something that it's not easy to just naturally find it. So, uh, which one had the lasers? The only other one with the laser is oh, the flying laser one, which is this one. And in the meantime, we died. Can we directly connect that? Yeah. <laughs> we don't even have to fly. Okay, I think we're supposed to fly that one up, so... But this works too. And we got our 10 stars.